thank you, Keon, for <laughs> he letting me know this to. is what you do. To, no, I'm He's saying he did it to me, too. <laughs> <laughs> just sitting here just, i just, just walked in here night, yeah. i asked you if you were open to butt stuff yet and you told me no and you letting him sniff cocaine off your butt I would never. Thing, i'm not i just i don't my nipples do nothing pleasurable right so it's like i know that's not gonna do anything and my butt's not gonna do anything either so i'm not into butt stuff but how do you know if you don't try it? Because I poop. have to try it. I poop. I poop. Okay. Well, I mean, we get burned, don't, don't, but don't I don't want you to stop going down. It. There's nothing <laughs> sexy or fun about poop. Right. That's what I'm saying. So Unless you don't have to wipe after when it's like that clean one and you yeah. wipe and there's nothing Even there. That's <laughs> sexy. That is. I mean, I, did, I have felt some ways I think that's about a, that. And I get the wipe and I'm like, yeah. I'll be impressed. Killing it. <laughs> Let's be honest. When you know I'll it's going to be like that before you even wipe. Like when you do Sometimes. it and you're like. No, that was because you usually like clean. a little pillow. Like I could yeah. just stand like up at this point. Yeah. <laughs> you do it, you're like that, I still, I still use a bidet. I still get the yeah. Spray but the spray like I always know when I go, I'm like uh, nailed it. And I definitely <laughs> nailed it. And then you wipe. You're like I knew it. You talk. You don't even throw it in away five regularly. Minutes. You toss it over your shoulder. And you walk five out. minutes in and it's poop talk. Thanks to Farron. <laughs> what? I didn't. Yeah, you did. Wait, what? so you guys have a bidet? Is that yes. what I heard? Yeah, a couple of them. Yeah. Like from multiple angles or multiple bathrooms? Multiple, multiple bathrooms. bathrooms. But that the one is in my, my 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 personal bathroom, it has like a lever so you can move the move the thing forward and backwards. So yeah. and then the other one that we have, you can just turn it down and it hits you at a certain angle or it hits you at a different angle. So the one so, but they, it's never slipped in <laughs> No. No Oh no, no, it has it's definitely got up there. You talking about the string? So he has tried bust up. The string? Yeah, has it got up my asshole is what he asked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it definitely did. Was it, was it uncomfortable? It was. You know what? It, it's a weird pressure. But then pressure. you settled into it. And no, you were like, no, you know I what? Clinch. This is home. Ooh. I clinch. <laughs> I clinch immediately. Hot I water. feel it. I'm like, oh, nope, that ain't it. Because it makes you feel like you're about to shit real yeah. quick. It's a quick. <laughs> okay. The first it time we got a shower like... head when I was in high school. And remember, you know, shower heads wasn't a thing. Yeah. And then you get one, you're like, oh, we're fancy. <laughs> so I wanted to use it. So I was in the water, shot up, Ooh. and I just curled in the corner and cried mm-hmm. like a. <laughs> Like a lifetime rape tried victim, to, I was just tried to done. Press charges on it. <laughs> I was like, "This is not <laughs> nice." You see the shower head in the courtroom this today? <laughs> I slid down the wall. I was just... like, "No, sir." Oh my god, y'all so dramatic. Uh, okay, so I guess we should do a little. Hey, which camera did you say? <laughs> it's in a different spot now. Hey, <laughs> well, welcome back to more to the story. And um, I'm Farron Moore. I'm to hear more. And today we have, oh, I'm <laughs> terrible. I didn't ask how y'all wanted to be introduced. So introduce oh, yourselves care. for me. The today Keon we Pole. have Slap me. Keon and yeah. Carida Pole. Yeah. yeah. I know, but if I didn't know if they wanted to say more things, wanted me to say more things, usually I ask. No, nah, this, this doesn't feel like... I know you niggas. I, this, this, doesn't, this doesn't feel like work. You know I'm zooming. I give a, a, a different. You know, like, yeah, ladies and gentlemen, yeah. put your hands together for the comedian extraordinary actor writer. <laughs> never bombed in his career. Doesn't Mr. like Keon. butt stuff. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, who wants stuff up there? But... Also, doesn't like shirts. <laughs> no, I do not like shirts. Yeah, I'm okay with that. <laughs> She's like, no complaint. None. <laughs> Take, Take it, it off, off right now, Keon. She don't even know what she wants, though. <laughs> like, she doesn't know. Mm-hmm. She has no idea. She doesn't know what she wants until I tell her. Mm-hmm. Like, she don't know. Well, like, is, that, we be, is that food or is that like? like no, like, in, like when we met, when we first met, I was big. Mm-hmm. Like, I was <laughs> two hundred pounds, just like no muscle head, big. Yeah. And then she was, she we met. She was like, I don't like buff guys, right? <laughs> <laughs> I'm buff. Right. This is what we you're we get. rocking with it. We lose weight because we did insanity. We lose weight. I dropped 23 pounds. Mm-hmm. I kind of missed the muscle. Oh, yeah. I kind of <laughs> missed. Well, he looked like he had AIDS. Like, it I was just not okay. Because you were just used to 200 pounds. <laughs> I got down to where I'm in right now. Mm-hmm. But she was so used to that other side. Yeah. She was like, oh, I missed the muscle. I put weight back on, drop it again, but didn't tell her about yeah. the weight. And she was just like, oh, you look good. I was like, so you don't know. Yeah. You, don't, you have no idea. <laughs> Wait, how did what you it put is? it back on and then lose it without her noticing? How fast are you gaining and losing weight? I'm always fl- I, I fluctuate however I feel like 
You know what I mean? I, I, like He literally I'm, takes a dump, steps on the scale, and he's like, I just lost 15 pounds. And I'm like, not, <laughs> so not, fucking She just doesn't notice. You don't like butt stuff? Because <laughs> that is like, it's a gaping asshole to lose she 15 just, pounds in one sitting. She doesn't notice because she doesn't, she sees me every day, so you know you don't yeah, notice. But she don't, warm. she don't be seeing what I'm, so I'll just take a week where I'm eating like nothing but vegetables, but mm. I just don't say nothing. Yeah. And then I'm like, oh, I just dropped 10 pounds. You can drop it that fast that easily. If you eat right, like like right, yeah, you can drop. I lost really fifteen fast. this past month. Yeah, in, in oh, January. congrats. Yeah. Yeah, just That's like huge. That. I didn't lose nearly what I thought I should to not be eating meat, but the what six pounds I did lose, I gained that back last week because I ate <laughs> nothing but buffalo chicken all week. <laughs> You had to yeah. catch up. I was like, this is the one thing I miss the most, spicy chicken. And you literally I get went crazy. So you, get so you one just day cut out meat. Up, I went, and yeah. then you got to go back. No, it's not even we cut out, we like, only, we, we went completely vegan. Oh, yeah. uh, okay. But I was like, Not this even a chicken. day for me. It's, just, it's too slippery of a this slope. I, get, I can get one meal. Yeah, yeah. If you, I do a full day, I'm, I'm going to end up with heroin. And I think <laughs> that's where people mess up. Because it's not actually supposed to be a day. It's supposed to be a meal. Yeah. And people go. It should be lunch yeah. too. Don't do don't do go crazy on no, dinner because you go dinner. lay down with that shit. Right. Do lunch because yeah. ain't nobody getting like breakfast you ain't gonna eat your, lunch, biggest, yeah. your biggest meal at, at breakfast. You're just not gonna do it. You're not no. that hungry yet. Yes. How long have y'all been married? Five. Neither one of them. Knows. <laughs> right. So I had to think about Keelan's age. Yeah, like, it's really okay, like five. really we just got married after he was born. Yeah. Oh, so okay. however age he is, that's well, how. Well, how long y'all been together then? Uh. Not much better. Okay, cool. <laughs> <laughs> we met in 2012. Yeah, we like met in 2012. Like around Super Bowl, actually. I had the, su- the day before the Super Bowl. Oh, so like anniversary, like anniversary tomorrow, I guess. right? Yeah, we met the day before the Super Bowl in 2012. So, uh, and then we used to break up a lot, stuff like that. <laughs> so, like solid, mm-hmm. probably like how he said he's five, six, seven. What? That sounds mm-hmm. like us. We yeah. weren't solid till like a year before we got married. Yeah. But we like met 16 years ago. Wow. That's <laughs> yeah. crazy. Mm-hmm. She's walking around college. She had an ass on her. Oh, <laughs> the fuck is that? <laughs> Little did I know she was already two months pregnant. I was like, like, who been fucking that? <laughs> but also, <laughs> pregnancy you know, sex is the best sex. <laughs> <laughs> right, he did not shy away at I'm all. I'm not mad at I him. Didn't. Pregnancy but, sex is fire. I yeah. didn't realize until recently that because I think often about how much I change in my hair and like how I'm like constantly reintroducing myself to people, <laughs> and the same thing happened with him because I kept changing my hair. So he didn't realize the first two times he introduced himself, <laughs> he was introducing himself to the same person. This is true. <laughs> this is true. I also did a lot of day drinking, and by day I mean like by seven a.m. So. Oh, in college? Oh yeah. Well, that's, that's, that's pretty standard. normal. That's standard, yeah. yeah. That's yeah. Right, right. So you literally just had like a, a whole different hairstyle. All and he the was time. like, hi, I'm T. All the time. She would yeah. just switch it up. The colors, the length, everything. But that change. says something that he was actually checking for you, though. Right. You yeah. keep checking, he was like, this chick. You, know, you got a friend. <laughs> yeah. I've seen this other girl. He, had, he, was, he was in. She, right. She gave me a house phone number. and uh, <laughs> He always points that out. <laughs> She didn't give me a cell number. She that is a big deal. I did not deal. have one. I did not have a cell phone in 2005. So you were not living on campus? No. Okay. It was at this the time. This is a bootleg time. school, so it didn't no, even it's not, have it's not dorm. It's, it's, it's not It was not We've established. Community college? We've established. It was not. It was a commuter college, not a community. Oh, a yeah, commuter I went to college. Of those. And then we have we have dorms now. We have two sets of dorms now. We have mm-hmm. a freshman Ooh, dorm. and two. I like it says we, how he still goes there. I'm an alum. I graduated. I was the first... Mr. Harris State University. To do things. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah, they dope. I love my him. university. Yeah. I just did a. Uh, we're doing a, a contest right now with TBS to give out twenty five thousand dollars for student loans. Uh, right. <laughs> you had to have graduated by like two thousand fifteen, December first, two thousand fifteen, or after. So. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm sorry. Next that. time. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I was sad when I found out I couldn't enter. I, I like, know. Keep the money. Just give me the other money. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Okay. So what are we talking about today? Don't do that. So today <laughs> Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me. <laughs> Can I you turn know. down my headphones, please? I'm loud in my, my I'm loud, loud in my, my own. That's why I was trying to back up. Yeah. <laughs> right. I don't know if I'm loud or not. Because Jesus. I'm a child, okay? I never know what we're talking about until y'all find out what we're talking about. We it. don't do this show together. This is this is fair show. 
she has full control of it, full creative control, and she never tells me what Finally. we're talking about. <laughs> she <should>. She's <laughs> killing it. It's one of the few things she can control. You know what I'm saying? So I'm she can shut charge. your mic off entirely. No, well, I mean, you know, camp still works for me, too. Yeah. <laughs> but works he knows when we're in here for more to the story, I'm the boss. Yeah, all right, nigga. <laughs> she didn't even say that with confidence. So. I did. She's like, I'm the boss. I'm still right? working on yeah. it. I'm still working on it. You guys think I'm the boss? I'm new to <laughs> being in charge. Anyway. <laughs> you guys agree so, being the boss? <laughs> today, did you, okay, today we're talking about, like, once you're married, taking the man's name. Because we've talked a lot about it, and I'm like, why is this even a thing? Where did, where's the origin? Blah, blah, blah. So did you officially take Keon's last name? Yes. Right? Did you do it, like, immediately? I th- well, He's here's like, the thing. I don't know. <laughs> you did the paperwork. I said I was going to get the presents. You said you were going to do the paperwork. Which is unfair. Right, okay. Why do I have to do all the paperwork? I mean, I know it's my last name, but it's like so – do you know how hard it is to go to the Social Security office and the DMV? And there's, like – 15 exactly. steps to changing. I almost changed my entire name mm. just to be like, let's get it all done while we're here. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's it's such an experience. It she is. still hasn't taken my name. So I, I I'm mean, going to. At first, it was like, oh, I thought you were for anymore. No, she just, not just legally. Yeah. Um, She's still first, so if I leave right now, <laughs> that's not how it works. She don't get nothing. That's not how you it don't, works. You don't have the paperwork to prove who He's you are. Confused. No, what's this California common license. law marriage? Well, so, after 10 years. Oh, that's 10, awesome. right? Yeah, she got, she, got a couple, she got a couple years. So you get it together. used to be eight, and then they extended it. It's going to be nine, nine months. We have a marriage <laughs> license and certificate on file. There's <laughs> nothing you can do about that. That's fake. <laughs> <laughs> I have multiple copies hidden in different places. I got all the Try pictures. Try me. I got all the pictures. They got like a map to the treasure pictures. somewhere. <laughs> right. They ain't going to believe it without me. the pictures. I got all the pictures. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Anyway. Now try me, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, anyway, I just went down like a super deep rabbit hole, like about why is this even a thing? Where did it, you know, start and all that? And finding out the just the origin of last names specifically was just so dumb because people did not use last names. And so your last name was basically um, based on your parents' name. Mm. So if you were William's son, right. then you were Williamson. And I what? just learned this from Marvel. Son of Odin. <laughs> That's why I learned it. Because yes. they always call him Thor Odin's son. And I was yeah. like, oh, I thought his name was Odin's son, but it's Odin's son. And then I went right. down the rabbit hole yes. and found out your name was just your father and then yes. your son. Really? So yes. that's what Williamson, Johnson, like it was some guy named John. Yeah. He had a son. Johnson. You're John's son. So, so you're John's daughter? <laughs> I don't mine? know. He didn't count. <laughs> yeah. Again. So let, with Game of Thrones, you would just belong, your last name would be, I am such and such from the house of such and such? Yes, and you that's another thing. Yes. Like last names are also based on either your occupation or where you're from. So it was like, it would be Cotty Dad, like, I don't know, First Duchess goes? of yeah. York. Mm-hmm. And it was because she was from York. Okay. It had nothing to do with that actually being right. a last name because people didn't go by last names. Godfather. You've seen Godfather, right? Yeah. His name is Vito Andalini, but because he came from Corleone, yeah. he was Vito Corleone. Ah. Uh-huh. That's how, like a lot of people who came over in Ellis Island, they just got the name from wherever they was from. That's not their mm-hmm. name. So multiple people had the same last name because multiple right. people were from the same place? Yeah. See, that's crazy because it seemed like you start a lot of fights. You're like, yeah, I fucked Anne from uh... <laughs> <laughs> what? Right. Portland. Like, I fucked Anne from Portland. I don't know. How your not even look? the same person. Long hair? Yeah, she got long hair. <laughs> Bad ass. Yeah, she got a we bad ass. We messing with the same girl. That's exactly <laughs> what I was thinking about. <laughs> So thank God for last names, surnames, mm. also known as surnames. Right. Surnames, also, yeah. Oh, he's fancy. Mm. Um, I feel like he like snuck and read my notes and he prepared for today. No, honestly, <laughs> so, I just watch a lot of this. Is people you can't learn them from TV. I was watching cartoons with my kids <laughs> right. and learned all of this. Thank right. you very much. <laughs> Fuck school. You got to go to college, or I could just watch Thor. How about that? <laughs> How about son. that? Yes. Yeah, so in married names, like became a thing even further down the line than that and it was only to legally tie a woman to 
the the man. Was because it like you guys ownership? get lost. Yeah. Yes, yeah. it was exactly Wait. like ownership because <laughs> what you say? This nigga said because y'all get lost. <laughs> so you gotta be like, who do you belong to? Ah, that's mine. Nah, that's mine. <laughs> I forgot Department to put the name tag on. It was like a little white play place. Yeah. You drop us off before Walking you go shopping. Lot. Or were we lost? Was there a lot more room for like sleeping around? Because, <laughs> right? Yeah, I think I'm with him. <laughs> <He's> fine. <laughs> Excuse me. Right. Right. So was put it? The, just put this it, on your butt. This was it also a, <laughs> a way of showing ownership of the wife too? Yes. So it's so crazy because we've said like the origin of the institution of marriage is incredibly stupid. Dumb. And one of the dumb things is that. Before a woman got married, she was able to own properties, you know, sell property. Mm -hmm. She could sue somebody in her own name or, hell, be sued and all that. But once she got married, she lost all those rights. <laughs> Why do they keep doing and it's it? Like, That's so crazy. Exactly. And I'm like, what reason as a right. independent woman did you ever have to get married? We could have brought all that shit to the table and been building the <laughs> empire together. Now right. you just got to sell off all your assets? Yeah, right. it's like, can we just what, be so together? <laughs> like, why do we have <laughs> to? Nah. And then they kept doing it. Yes. Yeah, they kept doing yes. this. And yeah. then we couldn't get a house without a man. Mm -hmm. I mean, it was just a whole... Like you couldn't, in whatever property you had became his because of the whole coverture, you guys are one, and that one is the husband. Mm -hmm. Now, this so, motherfucker don't know a shit about being a handyman or a landlord. He just got <laughs> your property. Yes, yes. But you were digmatized, like and now everything's lost. <laughs> <laughs> even when uh, like we got married... Like everything was his name was put first. Not on that birth certificate, was it? What are you talking about? We Which had the kid? Kids. Oh, the Keelan. yeah, the one. That's I'm what made saying. me really like when because we was both like whatever when it came to marriage. Like mm -hmm. we was like, eh. yeah, we kind of did it like out of spite. Uh, no, no. obligation. Y'all not even married. We'll show you tomorrow, Dad. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> she did it like on be some there. like. You know what I'm saying? She's like, I don't want to be out. You know, I'm a, I'm a woman of color. I no, don't no, be no. Out. Hold on, hold on. That. I did say that. I did, did say, say that. that. But there was, oh, there's, I have this thing where it's like, okay, here I am pushing around these kids. I'm a woman of color, and I don't want people to automatically assume I'm single. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That was my thing that I was very afraid of. That's yeah. what I was um, say. But no, <laughs> but before that, I just wanted to backtrack. His family and my family, they were all coming to me like, well, why doesn't he want to marry you? Or like. Why aren't you guys getting married? Like, why is nobody talking to him? That's why true. is everybody it's, talking to me? It's right. always up to the guy when y'all get married. <clears throat> y'all can put, y'all can apply the pressure, but it's always up to the guy to be like, all right, I'm go ahead and make an <laughs> honest woman. Because everybody assumes that they want to get married, though. Yeah, that's yeah. why. I did, I told her I was like, nah, marriage is dumb. I told her in college, I was like, you look at the stats, motherfucker. If if yeah. if you found out a company, fifty percent. He never told me these things. <laughs> We just had a conversation. She was like, I still question why you married me. Because she knew how strongly yeah. I yeah. felt about marriage. Yeah. I was like, that's I didn't find out dude. how he felt, unfortunately, until after we got married. <laughs> then we sat down and he like, he, I saw his energy shift. And I'm thinking, oh, it's still about to be party time. We, this is just a label. And he like kind of shut down. I'm like, what? what's going on? And then that's when he came to me and like, this is what I think. And I was like, why the fuck would you get married if you thought it was that bullshit? <laughs> like, I would have never gotten married if I thought that marriage was this terrible. Like, exactly. We about to erase all that. Because like, yeah. I had a wrong. very warped perception of it. And I was like. Especially growing up in the church. Growing up in the church. And then she, I told her why I married her. But also like moving her out here from her family. And her family is everything. Me, I don't give a shit about a lot of people. Like I, I see my family. If I great, if I don't, I'm like nigga, I catch you on the next round. <laughs> like I don't, I, like I'm, I'm, I'm very moved by yourself type of person. Like I'm a lone star type person. And so for her to give up everything to come out here with me while I'm still chasing the dream, like I had nothing going. Right. You know what I mean? Like it said a lot about her. I was like, that's somebody that I could laugh with for the rest of my life. Cause she's gonna ride with me for the rest of life. So, right. but yeah. also you were like, wait, but is she stupid? <laughs> yeah, I was, I was like, she don't make good decisions. Like, I mean, if you had did a business plan on me at the time, I was like, well, fuck, I am a failing company. But, <laughs> <laughs> not making a lot of money, bouncing from job to job. Mm. I didn't have health insurance. I, I was thinking about that all the time. Tested yeah. at Planned Parenthood. You it had was promise. Like you when I when promise. I be like early when she met me, I'd yeah. be like what. Like I, I paid for like everything. I can, I'm like, really? what are you doing? Like this dick ain't that good. Like, what are you? What are you doing? 
I, I have nothing. I play with this dick a lot. Yeah, it's not that it's, it's, it's good, but it ain't. It ain't. You know, risk your life. Good. Yeah. It's <laughs> she got a job like two weeks after she moved out here, right? And I was. He just had kinda, been looking for like three months I before I ever looking. moved out here. Nothing. She was the breadwinner for a little bit, and I felt like I couldn't even raise my house. I mean, raise my voice in the house. <laughs> It was like, what's for dinner? What I said for dinner. That ain't what I act. Well, lower your tone. <laughs> I'm gonna go outside and text you in all caps. So you know, <laughs> so you know what the fuck it is. I don't know. I'd be like, but I let her know. Like I used to tell her, like I have nothing. Like I, yeah. she'd be like, let's go somewhere. I'd be like, yeah, who's going to pay for it? <laughs> <laughs> because I have nothing. I, I mean, come to find out later, he doesn't like to spend money at all. He so doesn't. that's always the Leon question. Leon is. Mm-hmm. Very frugal, and I, I use know. that in the but it's, it's it's from being broke all no, the time. No, I get it. Because I, I grew that. up like people be like, but you you grew up you know in suburb, two parent home, blah blah. Yes, I we grew up fine. Yeah, you know what I mean. Come to find out, my parents just knew how to make money work. We didn't have money like that, but they right. knew how to work it. But I moved out at nineteen. Mm-hmm. So from nineteen till hell three years ago yeah i was always so broke yeah so i'd be like you can't spend meanwhile she was working 73 jobs she would have i'd rather work more and make more to so spend more spend <laughs> and i would be like no yeah and I get so that. i just was always i don't like i've gotten looser as you know we've all come further along mm-hmm. but even still i'd be like when he says lose he means downloading apps to see if he can get any deals <laughs> he got money. honey on his That's phone <laughs> no here's the thing here's the thing too i definitely <laughs> have honey just got it two days ago here's the thing <laughs> yeah, my mom new. for Boy, profession is a now. buyer <laughs> uh-huh. So she's always like, you always look at three options before making a purchase. Like, that's what she does. She's mm-hmm. always looking for the best deals. Best, Your mama that's what she does collecting for quotes before she buys paper towels. Yeah. <laughs> so I do that with everything. She'd be like, let's go get, you know what I mean? It could be something small. Yeah. Let's pick up a shirt. I'm like, well, I need to check three different stores right. to see who has the best price yeah. on the shirt. And I'm, because she'll just go. Yeah. I hate mm-hmm. when she goes to the grocery store. I don't like when she <laughs> runs any errands. I run all the errands because if she goes... She's Jordan. gonna get the most expensive thing going she Foods. can find. She's not even gonna look though. She doesn't even bother looking. I'll just check the account. And be like sixty four dollars for popcorn. How did this? <laughs> why is this a thing? If it's expensive, <laughs> that probably means it's better for you. And that's so. a that's a <laughs> game. <laughs> that is a See, game, and she's bought into that. We fall into though. the retail therapy. I'd that's like, where yo. we end up spending too much when we're like shopping emotionally. Mm. Like, he will go to Ralph's and he's supposed to be like grabbing creamer, and he'll come back and it's like. Why did you spend $164 <laughs> at, Ralph's? at Ralph's? Candles. He but he but I feel like I'm like I who who Ralph's hurt you? Is not a place to Why buy did candles, you spend though. this much? Right. Why did you spend this much candles. on candles? Or he'll just get lost down the liquor aisle and it's like this looked good. <laughs> it's like liquor. But I always get her something. <laughs> That's not the that's point. The thing. Like, why would you I'd get be that? I'm like, I, got, I, like, I didn't no want you point. to get them. Don't get me some. Right. 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 My <laughs> thing is like, <laughs> if it says sale, I just automatically assume it's a good deal. Like, and I came home and he was, I was like, oh, this this lotion was on sale. It's usually twenty five bucks. He's like, yeah, but it shouldn't be twenty five bucks. Right. Like, and I was like, oh. So she came home. She spent. I forgot. Like twenty five dollar lotion is good though. Yeah. But she, the thing is, she goes, <laughs> she goes. Oh, they had a sale. They were giving away <laughs> lotions, colognes, blah blah. This lotion is normally thirty dollars. I was like, that's not how much lotion should be. So they just you gotta played try this you. One lotion. Yeah, yeah, it's I mean, called uh, Ahava. Ahava. It's they made sell with it at Ulta. Mineral water, like it sounds great. Water. Um, no, it it's turns your, Dead Sea salt. Yes, it's water and, from the Dead Sea. Yeah. I mean, yeah. <laughs> it's water from the Dead Sea. No, it is. It's made with water from the Dead Sea. Oh, the Dead Sea. I'm thinking yeah. like the sea. I'm, I got into something else. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> no, it's water from the Dead Sea. Because she didn't hear nothing you said, because all she heard was, I can spend more money. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're on my So side. tell me how expensive <laughs> this is. It's at Ulta, yeah, but it's, it's so good. It is so she got good. so bad, like, we have a joint account and I have my <laughs> own account because she couldn't be trusted with her own. <laughs> oh, no, you should do that That's anyway. That's how bad We it have was. a joint account for and bills then, and, yeah. like, house expenses and stuff like that. And she has her own account and I have my own account and then we have business Well, accounts. that's what we were trying to do. Yeah, yeah. but I can't have my own account. She can't have money. Systems. Oh. Like oh, she okay. is that bad. <laughs> she when she gets She's like, like when, it, I'm when she gets Lucky like banks. <laughs> <laughs> like like she by the way, she sprung on the on, on this like over COVID. <laughs> yeah. I did not know we were doing our Thursday night like little thing. Throwbacks. By the way, uh I just Online. I would just see like what was this nine hundred dollars? Well, I had a credit card charge <laughs> for I, I didn't know she had all this debt. I didn't know she I mean and I'm just I found this out last year. <laughs> 
just different debts on top of different I'm sorry, debts. I'm shouldn't be laughing at your pain. Different <laughs> yeah. debts. I'm sorry. And I'm just it's like, it. what the? So finally, I was like, just pay all the shit. Just clear it all off. And we're closing these accounts. We're doing, you can't be trusted. Like now when she gets cash, it's like she'll buy stuff on a card for work. Yeah. And they'll give her, you know, cash or whatever. Yeah. And then she'll just come home and give me cash. And I'm like, what is this for? Just hold it. <laughs> Take it from Because I can see the cash is like, spend me. <laughs> when you when you are I'm marrying serious. somebody, you absorb this. all of that. And you don't know. I like, had no idea. When she first moved out here and I added her to the insurance, the car insurance, <laughs> I didn't know she had a bench warrant. What? No, I did not. It wasn't a bench warrant? No, it wasn't it was a, a bench okay, warrant. Okay, it was a it was a I ticket. Had, um, I had, right. had a recent ticket, and so because of it and prior tickets, <laughs> I needed something called a SR-22, so that was still, like, taking points off. SR-22 is insurance for, for people who have oh, multiple accidents or DUIs. <laughs> I've never had a DUI. No, I said, I said, or, or. I'm just saying. I yeah. just want to clear that up. in that category. <laughs> don't put me. Oh, uh, y'all, you, you motherfuckers are lateral, don't you? <laughs> hey, 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 so hey. Y'all anyway, running together. Moving <laughs> along. So. Come on, Miss Brown. <laughs> <laughs> right, marriage. Marriage is This strange. podcast should be done in a car while she's driving. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. <laughs> she would, Farron gets motion sickness when she's doing anything other than driving. Mm. She can't look at her phone. She can't read. She can't, like, d- like pick out playlists. Sometimes I can't playlist. even look out the window. Yeah. She, yeah. It, uh, only thing she can do is drive. <laughs> Otherwise, it's like, mm, pull over for a second. Just, mm-hmm. So it's road just roll down, down all the windows. Yeah. I, I don't yeah, ever so need how to pull do a road over, trip? but I roll down the windows. Like, if uh. that air hitting my face like helps me stay brown. She's like a poodle okay <laughs> <laughs> and i didn't understand it i didn't realize how severe it was i am like keon in certain instances especially <clears throat> when it comes to like money and gas so we would have the air on i'm blasting the air and then infinity and i only say infinity because it's a premium car like it takes premium gas right. so i'm like the air is on <laughs> it's burning more gas and she got this window down just like what i Head to the back, eyes closed, <laughs> and just feeling the breeze on her face. And I'm looking at her like, who the fuck raised her? That she don't know you ain't supposed to have but this window down. I've They're always, just making a noise, too. Like, I didn't. Oh, it's only it's one all window. window down. Yeah. I told you, have you that's a thing. I know. I've you have to do always both ran the air and had the window cracked well, that's when fine. I would ride It's a myth that it burns but the gas. he. Not, I know. He yeah. told And I don't know how. Oh, guess what else I just found out. It. It's not illegal to leave your, your light on in the car. It's not? Black mothers have just been it's telling their kids that. No, no, no. It's illegal. I heard, I heard it was illegal it's, because it's a distraction. It's it's uh one of those things where it's like oh, technically it's, yeah, it's frowned upon. Like something hanging from the... They right. say that's yeah. illegal too. Okay. Like yeah. you're not so supposed to like, drive with your plaque. Like if a, co- if a cop sees you... He, that could be reason to stop he, you. Yeah, but it's not like they'd be like, I don't give a he shit. He can't yeah. ticket you. It's like, like what's the code? What's the code? Like, Before uh, you give me the ticket, what's the code? <laughs> right. Like, so it's one of those things where it's like it's Both of y'all technically sitting there a racing thing, each other on Google looking like, for. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, it's it is technically illegal, but it's like, like not a thing that's like ever enforced. That you be cited for. Uh, I'm just I mean, gonna start riding. Around. We're black, so it's yeah, like with the light on. No, you're not. No, you're not. I'm just gonna start. Miss Brown. No, you're not. Exactly. This is what she acts like. Farron Brown would do it. Yeah, because she's from East St. Louis. No, I'm not. St. Louis. I'm from Bell Vegas, Illinois. I wanted to um, say one more thing though mm-hmm. about changing the names, uh-huh. just because um, I didn't do it for. Well, I did do it, but it turns out I filed the paperwork incorrectly, and so this whole time I had thought I was a poli, and I was not. I was a Rivera, and I was like, "What's taking so long for me to get this, you know, stuff back?" Mm-hmm. And then finally, his aunt hit me up and was like. Hey, you know, I don't know if you were gonna change your name or not, you know, but like it's it's kind of a thing that makes the man feel better. And I was like, ill. And then <laughs> yeah. Keon looks like I'm indifferent. It's no, I don't be giving a shit about nothing for real. <laughs> but then I realized I was like, oh, I never filed it correctly, and then I had to go back and do the whole thing all over again. So I worked hard for this last name. There you go. <laughs> yes, she did. Like, I hey. earned it. Yes, she did. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> yes, she yeah. did. Huh? <laughs> we got proof of that. Two of them over there. You worked very hard for this. Last name, you know what's crazy? I didn't care about the last name until uh, <laughs> the first kid was born, yeah. and then when the doctor we came in, at that and time. so it said, you know, they give automatically give the kid the mom's last name. Mm-hmm. Where and is then, this? Because they don't do that everywhere. Yeah, so they, they did it. At it our came hospital. in like because you know, so the kid don't get lost when they they automatically just put. Oh, not on the birth certificate, just on the bracelet. Oh, yeah. okay. So yeah. they don't get so lo- then uh, taken. So then, when it comes to the birth certificate and stuff, 
she the nurse comes in she was like so are you the father you be signing i was like bitch yes like what i got i was so mad <laughs> right. i'm like how she know we ain't got different we got different <laughs> last names like she don't know <laughs> so then i was like yeah you taking my last name you're gonna be asking me if these are my goddamn kids <laughs> like, I, was, I was so mad <laughs> and i was like yeah we getting married but get the last name now put it down on there because yeah let's get somebody in here right now right because <laughs> i was like <laughs> no, drug up, and, and she was really asking advice. she was really mm-hmm. asking like just you like oh are you and i was like yes that i finished in there that was me you see this they asked I me if I, was, if, if I was the dad, too. Yeah. I was there when she gave birth to the kid. And uh-huh. then her mom and her sister came and they kicked me out of the room. But <laughs> I, w- I was there and they were like, are you the father? I was like, ah. <laughs> <laughs> It's weird, you know. Yes, I'm going to be there. No, not. That's a seed. I didn't, and I, I gave put her, it, but I'm her water bio it. dad's last name because I took terrible advice from another baby mama, basically. <laughs> and um, I was like, I, in hindsight, I was like, I should have just gave her my last name. But they're, you know, thinking about the whole um, child support aspect of it. And I was like, wait, paternity. I was like, I was just dumb. Like paternity could figure that out. The last yeah. name don't have to match, yeah. but. It's too late now, but it's just, yeah, I wish I had just been like, you know what? She's going to be a brown. Mm-hmm. But, oh, well. Yeah, three different people with three different last names. <laughs> Under yeah. the same roof. Y'all got Under roommates. The same roof. Yeah. That was my office home. be confused as hell when they drop it off me. I have right. to put our names on the inside of the mailbox. This was the Morris, but this was brown, <clears throat> and now this was you. That was my whole upbringing, though, because I have four sisters, three different baby dads. Ooh. So, like, our she thing was said, Perez, oh. Rivera, Gonzalez. Like, it didn't even fit. One of them was probably, like, half knocked off. But it was, like, they knew, like, oh, shit, this woman gets down. <laughs> Deliver <laughs> here. Okay, y'all, stay focused. Shoot. Yo, God, it is so fucking she funny, is. dog. She is. I wish we had so much more time to hang with them. It's I so know. funny. Every time we're around each other, we just talk and talk and talk. And it's Can I just so say so one great. thing about this when, is we, when we first say talked? Say things, yes. <laughs> we, we first talked... I was extremely drunk later, but the time that we were talking sure. for the first time ever, mm-hmm. we had this moment where we were like, did you, we just become best friends? <laughs> like, cause we just, everybody would come and kind of talk and then walk away and come back. But we just kept going yes. on and on and on. I don't, we went from like mystery books to like drugs. It was just like. <laughs> was this at Kale's house? Yeah. 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 That was a good yeah. time. Yeah. It was like was the really best conversation ever. Right. It's it cool really to have was. a good tribe. That's yeah. what I was saying. Yeah. At uh, Greg's thing, it's like, yo, we finally got a tribe of people that we consider like, yo, these are our people. We're yeah, they bring yeah. the kids by today. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. And then we're bringing them all to your guys' house. That's fine. Just let me know when so I can leave. <laughs> <laughs> kids are so loud. Like, yeah. They're just so loud. Yeah. Are, I'm like, play all are. you want, but do you have to do it at this level? Like, it's just, why are you this loud? You know what? You, you you can't do it, but you they have to have an uncle that sh- that strikes the fear of death in them. <laughs> it can't be you because they won't feel comfortable bringing things to you. Yeah. But when this uncle comes around, it's got to be like oh, I learned can. this later. See, I was trying to be that dad to her. So like we are we 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 have a better relationship now. But at first, it was just her and and, and fair. Like I was just like the yeah, military. It was a very us and him yeah. energy. And I, I had to learn how to be yeah. I try to take, like, I'm still the disciplinarian in the house, but I definitely try to be the firm person, and it's just how I discipline them yeah. so they don't freak out. Yeah. So, like, now when they're doing something, I'm like, hey, man, what do I actually do, bro? Yeah. Like, you know, where they don't freak. Because if I raise my voice or if it gets stern, they just, they have they a just shut They down. can't do it. They can't handle shit. Yeah, they're so just- weak. I these can't handle generations, it these they kids can't soft. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> I, can't, I can't handle it. No, because I, I didn't grow up with a dad. So when I hear him raise his voice, I'm like. <laughs> oh, see, I had uncles. I had an uncle that was quite possibly bipolar and just nobody really understood that because you just never knew if he was going to be like a playful uncle today yeah. or for the next hour or so or if he was just going to be like super angry uncle tim uncle tim so or if he was going to be <laughs> like himself. this very like you know just aggressive guy so it was it could and go he either way and you just uh, didn't know what to expect dead. so it's yeah. like hey <laughs> Which one he came to our wedding. Oh, that one. I'm going to sit down. And he introduced in himself <laughs> 16 times oh, in as, a two minute speech. As Uncle Tim. He stood up. I'm Uncle Tim. <laughs> <laughs> the bride's on. I love him so I'm, much. Uh, I'm Uncle Tim. I just want to say this thing about Fair. You know, she's always known me as Uncle, Uncle Tim. Tim. <laughs> <laughs> I 
sitting next to her like, hey, your uncle drunk as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we get for having an open bar. Oh, my God. We didn't okay. have a wedding. Listen, we heard horror stories about weddings. Yep. We spent less than $5,000 on oh, that's everything. Dope. That's amazing. Flights, dresses, my groomman's jackets and, and car, oh. everything. And the, the thing that cost the most money was the photographer. Mm. He was like a grand. Everything else, Made I called work. in every favor. <laughs> every favor. Yeah. Even the honeymoon was included in the, and under that $5,000. Even spending that after yes. the fact, we were like, That's we right shouldn't have did alley. this. That's yeah. right up my We were still I, like, we shouldn't have done it because we only did it to appease our mothers. Yeah, yeah. that's all Especially did. back going back to St. Louis for it. It's like. Oh, it was a destination wedding and under 5000 Yeah, because we flew to St. Louis to do it. Um. And the place that we had the wedding was the same place we had the reception. The guy that owned the building, it was like a lounge. It, it was new, so it looked amazing. But he was a pers- per, per, I'm sorry, a professional, chef. professional, professional chef. chef. So he did the he did the meal. Personal friend. No, <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, is he a pedophile? It was, it was all kind a of things. Private like, investigator. What's like, what are you saying? He owned the place. He was a professional chef and uh, a pastry chef. So he did the cake and the oh, food. Oh, dope. dope. So he got the place down to like twenty eight dollars per person, mm-hmm. something like that. Uh, yes, it wasn't until I was planning my own wedding that I was like, so I'm just paying for people to eat. Right. Yes. Yeah. Basically. Like this is just so people like the major expense is just for making making a party mm-hmm. so that people can eat. Yeah. yeah. And, drink. I, and I just didn't care. like I watched. We had got married. My brother was in the middle of doing all his wedding stuff when we were going to get married. And I was just watching like I'm not doing none of this shit. Even though, <laughs> And I was already against. I always felt like it was a waste of money. And then I put a poll out on Facebook and I was like. For those of you who are married and had a wedding, how many of you would take it back and use that money for a down payment on a house or honeymoon or whatever? And how many? It was like 5% that was like, my wedding was worth it. Everybody else was like, man, fuck no, that wedding. Like, right. I would have spent this on this, If we that, had that. spent that like five grand on like a, a nicer honeymoon, because of course we scammed on the honeymoon. Yeah. <laughs> It's like that. That would have been more right. like beneficial. I mean, yeah. a lot of people said but they would have even had just a wedding and then a fire reception. Mm. They was they was like the, they was like all oh, that other stuff was dumb. So I was like, and I was watching my brother do his, and I was like, I wouldn't even feel right asking people because we had kind of got into it because all the stuff that I had to spend money on. Mm-hmm. I was like, nigga, you getting married. Why do I have to spend mm-hmm. all this money mm-hmm. because you're getting married? And then he was getting mad that everybody had an input. I was like, when you ask people to spend money and do stuff, they're going to want an input, input because yeah. you're asking favors. You know what I'm yeah. saying? And I was just watching. People like, just assume you're going to be quiet and just right. respect the fact that, but some people, they're tighter with their money. So it's like, yo. And people who get married don't realize we gotta no get one a else suit cares. Here. I saw the same you. color. <laughs> downtown that i could purchase right not oh, just rent right. for the same price and it's i like, am <laughs> i'm petty Man, don't you get but, married while you still owe me money man <laughs> I'll, I'll come to the wedding like the other day. anyone that feels these two shouldn't be where me because he owed me 20 dollars. Right. so before y'all say y'all i do you're giving him a card and, and it is a little note you owe me yeah right. <laughs> Like Farron was saying, people, I think people just really, it's about me. And blah, and yeah. It's like, no, nobody no. gives a shit. No. Like, you care. Maybe your mama care, whatever. But, like, my, my brother was, he was real. He's very, my brother is very, like, he celebrates birthdays big. But mm-hmm. he's he's excitable. He's yeah. he's excited about everything. Yeah. Whether it's him, me, or whatever. And I get a t- tiny TV credit. My brother, didn't, he's just an excitable <laughs> person. Yeah, that's correct. So when it came to his wedding, he was full bridezilla. Like, it's my day. Like, he was doing all that. And we was like, nigga, we don't care. Yeah, <laughs> like we it is a piece of paper we do right. not care you want everybody to match your level of excitement we don't care yeah. the day of it was a great wedding it was fun like they were like no kids and we was like we, we all have kids you have little cousins like what are you I doing I get it I said no kids too I had and everybody brought their like, kids and it was fun yeah can but I bring your can little cousin? Them. I was like, mm-hmm. no. Yeah, my mom did the same thing. My mom was like, your cousins want to come? I was like, well, I'm, no. I'm, not, I'm not paying for them. Right? Yeah, well, no. you don't want to pay for them to eat, yeah. no. I mean, well, we had, had Keelan was one. I'm no, like, bro. No, he wasn't. He was like six months old. Yeah, he was a, he was a baby. And I'm like, we're bringing, And I was still nursing. A, yeah. so, and He's not everybody, eating food. That's our family was so there. So either like, that or you're going to be mad at me for leaving early. So just right. let me or not I'm not coming. coming. Or I'm not coming. I have a yeah. baby. And right. I'm like, plus my our but, parents are going to be. You don't think they're going to watch their grandkid or aunties? Or, well, you'll be fine. Really. <laughs> and everybody brought their kids and stuff. And it was fine. It was a fun wedding. Yeah. But he was just was doing fun. the most. And I was yeah. doing that. I was like, we're, we're never doing that. So real quick. 
I want to run down like alternatives to the woman taking the man's name. Mm -hmm. And one of them is hyphenating, which I hate. Uh, For my just own, I just don't think it's pretty. (laughs) But (laughs) but that's just me. Like what's It is weird. Like it stands out too. It's like, for what? Why are we doing this? And then also like some people even give that same hyphenated name to their kids. And it's like, this sucks for a kindergartner. Yeah. <laughs> so also the hyphen never signed up for that. Like this just seems like a lot <laughs> right. of work. I gotta be right in between these right. two. Holding names. Like this family, the, holding the family yeah. together. Yeah. They get a divorce. The hyphen sitting so there struggling. <laughs> That's too much. It's oh like at God. the end of the day, I have um uh someone I know very close. I won't say any more than that. But she was married twice, so she had both of her married names, and they were hyphenated. Oh, and sorry. I'm like, why didn't we just go back? <laughs> Why didn't we that just, is wild. Just either keep that one and be like, look, this is who I am right. until maybe I get married a third time <laughs> go back or just go back to your mate name. Yeah. Like, why are you, you got two other niggas names hyphenated? <laughs> but the, she didn't still have the, the mate name, too. It wasn't no. like maiden, married, married. Oh, she was just, no. just no. married. It was just she dropped off her maiden name and it was just married, married. Oof, what? And it's like. That's Baby girl, that's what pictures are for. You don't have to. <laughs> you don't have to yeah. try to remember so every I aspect. I never of understood it. it. Like I remember as a kid trying to decipher what her last name was because then I had also heard her her maiden name, and I was like, I don't understand that's why isn't she this person? She's not married anymore. Like I was a very confused kid. There should be rules if you're gonna hyphen. Yeah, yeah. the two references you gave you about your friends, you need. It's glad, I'm glad you moved. You need new friends. No <laughs> friends. On the third marriage, you shouldn't even be able to take your spouse's name. You just got to be like, yeah, we together. Your name should be a, a question mark. <laughs> yeah. uh, by the third time, it should be. It should be right. just uh, just this emoji as, as your name. Like, we might make it. We might not. I don't, I don't know. That's a lot, man. Okay, another option is taking the wife's name. Have you guys ever considered in... They do it in other countries. Yeah. They do. It's just that I already have merchandise. That, <laughs> and my last right. name it's is so brand. unique, I yeah. can't let it go. Because yeah. like, nobody else has it. If you right. have my last name, you are do in Do you know the family. origin yeah. of your last name? Like, Was uh, it a combination of some other I know names? it's French, but I don't know what it... Probably before a that, master. You know, African before that. <laughs> no, I'm serious. Yeah, yeah. It's very possible, yes. Yeah. But my last name is one of those like if you have it, we don't have to know each other. We'll we'll figure out how I we're related. related. Yeah. Yeah. And then I did do a search, and my family has so many damn boys. That's oh, why there's so, so many. So, so many. everybody's right. related. Like I looked it up because I was like, I have two boys. My brother has boy. I have four, uh, three brothers. Like we just do boys. Like that's all we do. And mm-hmm. so I, one day I was just looking up because there's so many polies on Facebook. And then they started finding me. Mm-hmm. And I was like, nigga, I don't know you. Yeah. Yeah. But they're like, we're related. I was like, I believe you, but I don't know you. And then, right. so they made like a little group and everybody was like, okay, your uncle is this. And then when we went back. Y'all did your own ancestry. So we did it. And Good. as we started going back, it was like one guy had like six boys. And then his dad That's had nine boys. And then oh so it's just God. so many boys. Yeah. And then they just like it's it's a sprinkle of girls. And <laughs> yeah. then it's just boys, boys, and then Jack. And then and then it was just so it's just so many polies. Right. Well, because it should it's just probably all boys. be pole. Yeah. Yeah. With an accent on that, but you know. Right. So now so I I'd never thought about giving up my name because I was like, mine is unique. Like I'm the only Keon Poli mm-hmm. on earth. Like yeah. I'm the only one. I'm like I'm not gonna give up that right. name. Yeah. Shows yeah. Rivera, is, pff, that's, that's well, a dime a dozen. <laughs> that was the only one of my names that everybody could pronounce. Like Rivera, it was so easy. My yeah. first name Caridad. People can never get it. My middle name is Japanese. Oh, tell us what Sakura. is it? Sakura. Sakura. Yeah, so Sakura. then I had to get his last name, which nobody can pronounce either. So it's just <laughs> a whole fuck fest. That's just for, na- for <laughs> now. Harida Sakura Pole. Yeah. And yeah, which like people say Pole. No, no, hold on, wait, let me try to get Cut it out. Because you're not yeah, saying the D. The first one, you're not Japanese. saying the D at the end. Right. Well, the first one Caridad. is in Japanese. Caridad. <laughs> it's Spanish. So it's just Caridad. I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna say the Spanish one in Japanese, and then the Japanese one in Spanish. You okay, are trying to. It. You're depending Caridad. so heavily on your tongue to cooperate. Right. <laughs> right. And it will not. Be. Wording is hard. <laughs> Caridad. Okay. What's crazy is like when I met her, she told me her name. I was like, all right, Caridad. Like it was. It wasn't hard. Yeah. And I was like, yeah. And she was like, oh. And her, her and her sister was like, you got it. And I was like, if not. Because the struggle like, is real. That's why I didn't give him my first name at, even when we first met. Because I'm like, I've dealt with country ass people <laughs> who mess up Farron. You can say Darren, Karen, yeah. Sharon, but somehow 
Farron turns into Fern. <laughs> and it's like that's not the same thing. And I really like my name, so I used it's to get dope. offended. And it's like, you People know mess what? up you my don't first deserve name. It. Last name. <laughs> and they'll be. Why they'll, do they mess up Keon? I don't know. And then the thing is, oh, they'll my be mom looking at it. Puts an extra emphasis on the O. They'll be like, they'll she be like, Keon. I get called Keenan, <laughs> Kevin. <laughs> but I'm like, where do you? Where are you? These extra letters I that get you're it, seeing. I have a friend. That, her name is Rakenya, but we called her Kenya. And my mom would mess up her name every time. I went to school. Like we were close friends for four years, and you, she never figured out how to say this girl's <laughs> name. She's like Rokenia. It's like. <laughs> But if you take the rut off, Mama, what do you see? Kenya. Kenya. But I was, I was like you. I was like Leon, <laughs> Neon, Dion, right? <laughs> Just add the. It's the same thing. Yeah. Yeah. And then my last name, people be like Pool, Pole, Peel, and I'm like it's P O L E E. If you spell Pole, add another E. Lee. Just break it up. Pole Lee. Lee. It's, That's it. Just it like it's spelled. So simple. And, and they be like confusion. Peel, Pool, Pooly. I'd be like, where, how did you add these oh, extra O's? Where are you? What people are you just doing? Do what they want to do. They right. just don't care. Yeah. So um, I do like this, like, I won't even call it new. People have been doing it for a long time. The merging of names to just get something new. Like, it was um, heavy in the Jewish community. And it was also a military tactic to just, like, phase out people. You would just change their names to what suited you once oh, you shit. took over a country or some shit. Um but the um, Jewish people didn't really use last names, but and they were forced to um, by the government. And but then once the um, the change of power happened, and they were forced to change their last names again to make it easier for the people in power to pronounce. So it was just. I was like, I kind of like that, but I've also heard some like real crazy creations with people just <laughs> melding their names together. I kept trying to figure out what ours would be. More bore, <laughs> broar, right? Mound, like no, so more. they would merge their last names together Mound. to create one ba- name. Bowen, yes. Mound. Interesting. Mound. Well, you know, yeah. Jewish people also don't have middle names, so they really? didn't have middle names and last names. They they, they did not like. In in the beginning, like years ago, it wasn't until yeah the late seventeen hundreds, early eighteen hundreds that they started using last names. So I like that, and I also like the fact that I mean I haven't done a serious search on my family lineage or anything, so I don't know where the name Brown came from. Doc. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Very popular movie. Everybody knows that. it's fact historical. Look it up. Uh, I thought it was from Cleveland. <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> Low hanging fruit. Um, <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> that you gave for having a common last name. See, if it was Poli, you did, there's no jokes for that. Uh, yeah, too unique. I, like, I, I have no idea where like my line of Browns, because Brown is a pretty common last name, too. And I didn't realize that it was like a whole everything's a fucking movement but there's a whole movement <laughs> of black people who know that like their lineage from slavery mm-hmm. and so they realized that their last name was their slave owner their you know last name and so they just decided to completely change their names yeah. to drop it yeah. and but there was also like some people who were like I want to keep it mm-hmm. because I have other family who went through this plantation mm-hmm. went through that same slave owner and will be able to find, find each, each other, other later yeah. so it was um that's when you got to get like you got to go back back to, to the house you're like such and such such and such formerly house of yeah. <laughs> right, like, but I ain't carrying that name no more, fam. Right, right. But I like. Um, I was just still wondering, like, why do women still do it today? And it just seems like tradition. guilt and tradition. Yeah, I think yeah. it's really just a dead tradition. The same way that we do, we do so much stuff. Like how I had a warped perception of what marriage was supposed to be, mm-hmm. and you know, we had to talk about making it what we needed it to be for us. And I think that, like, especially, like you said, when you come up in a church, like, you just get taught what your parents were taught, Mm -hmm. and they got taught what their parents were taught. And there's so many things that are different now, like, 
just the fact that you know women can own property and you know keep their property and they can divorce a man and they can vote and they can yeah. vote and they can voice their opinion like everything has changed except for the initial description and idea of marriage and i feel like that's it needs to be updated yeah well, i appreciate you questioned. not pressuring me into changing my name because nah, i, I like, just give you shit about I it i i was like going through a whole identity crisis i was in no i ain't rush. shit about that shit <laughs> Uh, I'm surprised yes, my family did. was telling you that. I was like, "Yo, it was like it's a okay. DM. They never came to you about this, so you find out. Well, my from mom her. would be like, "Are you gonna marry her?" Like, Nobody oh. comes to him <laughs> about anything. Everybody in his family comes to me. Really? Because they already know. I'll be like, "Wow." He doesn't care about my you. family knows. I'm not gonna talk. <laughs> <laughs> like even in the, uh, some of our group chats, they be, they'll I'm in the group chat, and instead of asking me directly, they'll ask Farron to ask me because they know <laughs> I'm not gonna say anything in the group chat. I just be it be too many people sometimes. I just be like, yeah. Shut oh, up. he got upset got in a family, family group, group chat. Group like chat legit was. They just kept talking. Like at first it was an, a question post. The question was answered, but then they kept going i was like turn t- take me out of this like <laughs> and they was like just you see why they, they was like take your notifications himself off. From right the chat. because i would have to turn my note no, because it was in a regular chat so i'd have to even the was mute this an android or this was no, no it's it on iphone. iphone but even in the mute you know it still lights up i don't like seeing like i like now you take the notifications off i would have to turn them all off and i no, needed other don't. stuff uh, this this was a while ago yeah, no, this was, it, no. it was mix of Android and yeah, so oh, it was okay. all okay. yeah, so it was green. Yeah, yeah but if it's a if it's a um a group chat, you should be able to slide it over and turn the the, the half moon on, and that means that you won't get notified for anybody from that that conversation. But even for that Android, yeah. Because oh. no, it's still know. in the thing. Mm-hmm. It, it's just like when an Android replies with a picture or something, it'll come in a separate message. Mm-hmm. But that yeah. should have been the only thing that you should have done. I don't know. But, I, but it, what, what happened was because I was filming. Yeah. And I was trying oh. to edit and shit. You know how when that stuff keeps, and you just Man. get frustrated. Like, cause, like, stop. I have been screaming. And they wasn't talking about shit. Yeah. That's, that's what made me, I was like, y'all not talking. Yeah, the screen record. Oh, and then my it popped God. in the screen record. So I'm doing on stuff for my, like, for work. I I'm like, y'all not talking about shit. Flip over uh, <laughs> Shut up. a three story building full of puppies and kittens. Stop. And then just, I just, just, like, none kick of the jokes was hitting in there or nothing. No. I was like, these jokes is trash. <laughs> y'all not like, none of this is funny. Y'all want to catch up I on real bad. Bad. Telling jokes around comedians is like trying to talk food around a chef. Yeah. It's like you never feel quite adequate enough to be in the conversation. When people be trying no. online, I'd be like, you thought you thought that was good, didn't you? Online, like, online just, it'd be like, uh, look, I'm just an average citizen. Like, I'm not on your <laughs> level, so just accept my funny right now. You, you funny. You, I, I, just, funny. I just told I'm you. talking about the commoners. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> not us. <laughs> The We've been infused <laughs> yeah. being around you guys so much. She uh, she actually was always funny. That's another thing. That she was too. That's yeah. how we hit it off. Yeah, same thing. We texted yeah. like for a whole day. I was like, she is killing me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was like, she don't give a fuck about whatever job she had though. Because yeah. she uh, was texting me all, all, all day. She yeah. wasn't doing a damn thing. I was in the back of the kitchen like. Oh my God. <laughs> all right, we got to wrap it yeah, up. It's about that time. Yeah. So um, this was Thinking great. Oh, this is real quick. That went by really fast. It, and it was almost a whole hour, you guys. My but heart. just before we completely shut it down, I just want to ramble through this name change checklist. So if anybody's out there putting the pressure on your woman <laughs> about changing her name, it's a whole ordeal. And like half of it you have to pay for. Mm-hmm. So there's the marriage certificate you have to pay for. Social security card, that's free. Um, <laughs> the driver's license or state ID. You have mm-hmm. to pay for that. And go in into the DMV. Yes. So also wasting time. <laughs> <laughs> the ve- vehicle title regis- and registration. Mm-hmm. Updating passport. Oh, okay, um, voter registration has to be updated. That could be done online. Um, <laughs> that's free. <laughs> then if they ask for a maiden, <laughs> up- then there's an extra like time really yes. slot you have to fill yeah. out for that. Yeah. Um, updating your address with US, I mean your name with USPS as a fee for that. Um, updating $7. bank accounts and getting new credit cards oh, and just all your all the personal accounts with that's like linked to emails and all that stuff. All that stuff you have to start all over with and still when you fill out a legal form they're like are you known by any other name and it's like i just tried to eradicate this name <laughs> eradicate <laughs> jesus <laughs> punk ass name i just name. tried to wipe this name off the planet and you keep bringing it up you exactly. won't let it die so it's it's a whole ordeal yeah. um, i will say though i do 
I do like like even our circle of friends, like mm-hmm. you said, our whatever you called it, our Tried. village. Village. It is cool to be like, oh, you know, the Fredericks are coming over. Yeah. Or just to knock it out, like, oh, mm-hmm. the more like even when we go places as a family, I'm like, oh, the police are here. Right. Yeah. And I'm like, yeah. 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 And I mean that, that, we bonded. that, that we, belonging, we that sense of belonging. <laughs> we had sex raw, guys. It <laughs> feels that. great. But I also feel like she's gonna be referred to that regardless. Anyway. Yeah. yeah. So Regardless if it says it's on paper, they know what the fuck it is. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So, yeah. um, I, I honestly didn't Over care my that. emotional part of it, now it's just carving out time to actually take care of everything. Yeah. But so, that's good. I'm going to do it. <laughs> I've already printed the form. Fast I just need to come back. Five years later. <laughs> right. Five years later. It's like, right, I'm, right. I'm going to do it, I promise. Right, Keelan's graduation. <laughs> so, Farron, did you ever... Uh... <laughs> I didn't mean to get in the of that. <laughs> Keelan was like, where'd this gift come from? The brown moors. The brown moors they, gave you, the they gave you this. But this was so great, you guys. Thanks for joining us. Thank you. Thanks yes. Do you um, want to tell the people where to find you or things and stuff? Uh, yeah, you can find me at We're Tahir. not talking okay. about you. <laughs> I thought that the polies <laughs> uh, uh, at Keon Poli on everything K E O N P O L E E um, YouTube and Instagram because Facebook they'd be hating so I'm tired of going to jail <laughs> like, I, I just got off I'm just sick of it <laughs> yeah I don't even really be on there like that you can't say shit on there nah you can't what Facebook yeah is that bad. Oh, I got I got seven days for saying talking about gummy bears. They said it's harmful to animals. They don't read. They have bots reading these, so they mm. not. So if somebody reports it. Yeah, you know I mean that's just it. Harmful yeah. to animals. Oh, because of how they said made? I said bears. Oh, bears. They don't. They just look for trigger words. Like I got banned for saying white people once. They didn't know what I said in the context of white people. All they saw was white people jail. Like, if you could like, test it, a human being will get around to it. But yeah, maybe. you gotta wait for that. And with COVID, so there's like, like less done. people. They said. Yeah, um, I just don't care. Okay, how about you, Caridad? Um, I'm at this underscore Caridad underscore Poli. Huh? No more camel toe? You know what's crazy? Kev on stage said something to me, and he was like, he's like, you know, sometimes I want to tag you and stuff, but then it's like your Instagram <laughs> And I was like, at the time, I was like, so what's wrong? <laughs> and then I thought about it, I thought about it, and then I kind of got some like weird some things that people had said that just kind of rubbed me the wrong way. And I was like, maybe I'm inviting this. I don't know. I still think it's funny, but I, I let it go. It was funny. Too. Thank you. Make, <laughs> it, make, it, yeah, make it, make it a, um, a, whatchamacallit, like a, um, a meme account or something. I, I like Camel Toe too, but I would be feeling weird tagging my boy. This is my dog, and I'm tagging his wife. Her name right. is Camel Toe. Like, that ain't your it. fault. I know. <laughs> That's not your problem. It's, 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 it's a respect. It, yeah. I don't know why it's a weird thing. Like, if I needed, to, like, if I was talking to Cardi Dog all day, right? But then 10 o'clock hit, I would hit Keenan and be like, I mean, Keon, be like, yo, Keon, can you tell Cardi Dog to hit me tomorrow? I need to finish sending her just out of respect because of that hour. And I, I don't know. It's just. It's like if your name was fat ass Farron or Farron with the big old titties, <laughs> niggas would be like, "Yo, can yeah, I tag? Is like, it cool if I tag your wife in this?" It's just, it's just, it's just you know. Like, and I think sex is so like, really but, taboo. So it's yeah. like you know, there's a lot of like vagina positivity and like which mm. I think is fantastic. Mm-hmm. Like we're talking about those things, but, but it's, we ain't there yet. Yeah, we're not there yet. Well, I think okay. I think for, I understand where he's coming from. It's just for guys, it's just a different. Thing. And then it's like, like she says, stuff that people said. And it's like, even I had to be like, oh, my nigga. Uh. Mm-hmm. Not, and I don't even know these people, but I'd yeah. be like, yo, bruh, yeah. like, mm-hmm. chill. Right. And then so it was just like one of those things where it's like, uh, like it's funny amongst, you know, it's yeah. funny in the house or whatever. And then, you know, we're in business stuff. And you know, it's just like, well, you should Mwah. get it tatted on your arm or something. Don't she gotta, she gotta get it tats my taken butt off. Cheek. And then <laughs> you didn't even finish the one you got. That's another story. <laughs> <laughs> we'll talk later. about it once yeah. we once we end. Part oh, two. so we have an email account now. So Ooh. email us um, topics you want to hear. What's the email? Our I'm about to get to oh, it. Okay. Uh, that you want to hear our point of view on. Um, it's more to the story podcast at gmail dot com. All one word, no special characters. It's more to the story podcast at gmail dot com. Um, yeah, and let us know things and stuff. I was this really was hoping great. it would be like Brown Moore. <laughs> Why would I do that? <laughs> like, <laughs> Brown Moore to the story podcast. I was <laughs> hoping so much. It would be like a hyphenated or like at Baron Brown. I did not even know this. That's what I said. I found out everything when y'all find out everything. <laughs> 
no, it, no. we discussed that it needed to happen, so I did it. Okay. Cool. Like, you know me, consider it done. I do no. prefer my picture on my Rivera driver's license, though. Oh, my really? poly driver's license, I'm fat and pregnant. <laughs> To live with that, that just shows you earn the last name. You're like, look, this is <laughs> this is why I'm here. And let this nigga shoot up the club. You know, this is why we're here. That, that's proof. I think that's solid. Oh my well, god, that is. I mean, he ain't wrong. <laughs> Thanks for joining us, y'all. Thanks for having us. Thank you. <laughs> this was a great yes. time. All right, guys. Okay. We'll see you next time. Right. Peace out. <laughs>